One New Zealand horses continue to dominate our major races. Today, five-year-old mare Tiako Pearl finished powerfully to take out the $70,000 Werribee Cup. Tiako Pearl is now assured of a Melbourne Cup start and her price for the big race has shortened dramatically. Fifteen runners in the Werribee Cup were second declarations for next Tuesday's Melbourne Cup, but most were unqualified, while horses such as Cara Wynn and Cool Credit were needing a win to ensure a Cup start. Tiako Pearl, a very talented mare who was most unlucky in the Adelaide Cup earlier this year, was fully qualified for the big one. Today's 2600 metre race was run at a farcical pace early and it developed into a sprint home. The David Hayes trained regimental arms sprinted to the lead before the turn and looked all over a winner. Inside the 150 though, Regimental Arms three in front. Tiako Pearl finishing very strongly with moods. Regimental Arms is stopping. Flying Tiako Pearl, the outside. She lunged, she won. Tiako Pearl narrowly defeated Regimental Arms and moods in a great three-way photo finish. The mare will go straight into next week's $2 million Melbourne Cup. Trainer Michael Moroni had a starter last year. Selwyn's mate, his first. But he's got no doubts this mare will go much better. She's a chance because she's going to see the trip out. She's proven at the trip, which is... You know, it's got to be a bit of a plus in that race. Uh, she's peaking at the right time, so uh, she, I don't know if you've got to have a, a hell of a lot of class to win a Melbourne Cup, but you've got to be able to stay, and I think she'll do that.